Hey guys, welcome back to this new video. My name is Muhammad Junaid. So I am currently pursuing MCA from RV College of Engineering, Bangalore, uh, first year. As you guys know, PGCED 2023 application has been released. So I will be guiding you through this because last year I have written this exam. I came here by PGCET, uh, applying or uh, writing PGCET exam. Uh, so I will be telling you what is the process, application process, verification process and examination process and all, uh, seat allotment process, everything uh, uh, updates will be given here. So make sure if you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe to this channel, you will be getting notified whenever I put an updates regarding the PGCET. So the first thing is the conducting authority. So the Karnataka examination authority will conduct this exam. Uh, so PGC it means post graduation common entrance test 2023 so information bulletin has been released uh, the all the information regarding these examinations will get to know in the official website you can reach out to their official portal and get to know all the information uh, so I will at the end of the video will tell you where to get this all the materials and what are all the previous trends that are going to happen uh, we will sh share you at the end of this video okay so the candidates who are seeking admission in MCA, MBA, MTech program these candidates can write the PGCT entrance exam and get the admission done in government or private colleges within the Karnataka okay even the helpline number and the official mail id is also mentioned here uh, their official email id is ke-authority-nic.in and the official website is also there ke-in you can reach out there and you can get to all all the informations and the updates regarding this exam so publication of notification in the newspaper and on the ka website is 5th august and the hosting of the uh, information bullet is on 7th august online registration of application entrance will be from 7th august to 17th august so 10 days the application is open uh, today is date today is 9th august so make sure you guys apply to this exam if you are eligible or if you are willing to take admission in any of these courses within the Karnataka. The last date to pay the re registration fee is 19th August. Apart from this, there is the registration process. You guys have to register in their portal by entering your uh, basic details and get your user ID and password user ID in your uh, registered mobile number after getting your user id and password you guys can log into their website and fill all the information and the related documents like your category uh, uh, cast category documents and your all semester mass cards by uploading this and you guys have to pay the fees of 650 for a general category and obc category and uh, 500 for scst students okay and finally take the acknowledgement so mode of examination will be like pen paper examination you guys have to write it in offline mode uh, by going to the centers so for 2023 the examination dates are 9th and 10th september usually from past two years uh, the examination is conducting in the month of november but this time they have came back and uh, they are conducting on september so i hope your admissions will get uh, you guys will admit to the college by november or december okay on 9th of september saturday the mtech students exam will be there from 2 30 pm to 4 30 pm the 100 marks paper and on sunday 10th of september mc and mba exam will be there with the two slots morning slot will be for 10 30 to 12 30 for mca and 2 30 to 4 30 for mba so there as usual 100 marks uh, will be there i will be sharing you the process of uh, marks distribution and the exam preparation and all uh, because uh, last year i have gone through this exam so i don't only know about the mca uh, preparation plan i'm not sure about uh, mtech and uh, mba uh, you can get information in google or youtube videos over there and who are all eligible so as usual for uh, MBA there are two courses a uh, full time MCA and a part time MCA for a full time MCA the minimum of 3 years graduated degree should be there with a recognized university and the eligibility criteria is 50% uh, of the 
marks should be there in a graduation and for the SCSC candidate 45 percent of the marks should be there okay so same for uh, part-time MBA courses uh, but in addition to these candidates for obtaining a degree must have worked not less than three years as on 31st July 2023 so candidate who is uh, seeking admission in part-time MBA they guys have to be worked more than three years after the graduation and uh, the organized the whatever the college they are selecting should be in a 40 kilometers radius of their working place okay so this will be the uh, eligibility for mba and for mca the candidate who has passed any recognized bca degree okay bc or computer science engineering or equivalent degree candidates who have done bsc bcom ba are also eligible but uh, in their 10 plus 2 uh, level there should be the max as a subject compulsory subject passed bsc bcom ba with mathematics at 10 plus 2 level or a graduation level with the additional bridge course as per the norms of the concert universities okay as usual the marks should be in their graduation uh, should be minimum 50 percent of the marks should be there and 45 percent for scc candidates rounding of aggregation percentages is not allowed okay and uh, there is a no part-time course for mca as well as there is a no lateral entry for MCA. Currently, MCA is for two years only. Previous, there was a lateral entry concept. And same for MTech, 50% uh, for their graduation in BE and 45% uh, for SCST categories. And uh, for a part-time MTech also there, uh, as I told in additional, there should not be uh, less than three years of experience. Means you should have three more than three years of experience, okay? So okay, in Google, just type kea.kr.in. Uh, so you will be redirected to this page. Uh, this is the official website of KEA. Uh, in this portal, uh, go to the admission section. Uh, first of all, all the announcements, latest announcements will be uh, declared here. So as you can see here, all are the latest announcements uh, on the 7th of August, PGCD 2023 information bulletin brochure for candidates. So all the department's uh, announcements will be made here to get only the information about the pgct go to the admission tab here you will get pgct 2023 go to this page here all the information will be there this is the information bulletin brochure for the candidates here all the uh, process regarding the application verification marking schemes and seat allotment all the process is been mentioned here he, this is 82 pages document just go through this before applying uh, don't do any mistakes while applying the application i will coming up with the new videos regarding the online application application applying process and all uh, so stay tuned if you are new to this channel make sure you subscribe to this channel and uh, like this video if you feel that this is an informative video and one more thing if you guys want to know the previous year and what are all the things going to happen in step by step you can go to this previous year admission tab here you will be finding pgc 2022 link in this link uh, you can see first the information brochure is released on then online application timetable hall ticket download so these are the one or another one or one and the one links that are adding in this page so according to the schedule according to the things will get to happen final answer keys first round second round all the information will be just go through this to get a glimpse of how the things will going to work in pgc 2023 uh, apart from then just stick to this page only uh, admission 2023 uh, 2023 page only so that you get all the information okay so this is about the website make sure if you are new to this channel subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon to get notified coming videos i will be uploading uh, the application process preparation for mca and everything uh, okay so till then take care all the best prepare well bye bye